You gonna fit through there, buddy? Fatty. Come on. You ate too much this winter, eh? Oh yeah, nice. Now don't you get stuck in there. I barely actually got him in the at end gate. He is a tank. Frank the tank. Hey buddy, don't you look at me like that, huh? Go that way. Come on, let's go big boy. Let's go big boy, all the way up there. We might, hey big boy. Hi. He can't see Rocky, can he there? Can he see Rocky standing right there? Yeah. Rocky bug off. Yeah. Okay, here we go, big boy. Yep, up you go. All the way up there. I'm gonna lift his foot. You need it? Do you need me to try to lift it here? Uh, of course. And get that board? You already got the board? Yeah, I got the board. He's gonna probably step back here, so. Oh. Only brought one battery. I don't know if you've got to go under here. I think I will. I want to do this side too. Good. This side isn't as bad, was it? No, nope, not even. I don't know if you even need to do anything on the other side. No, I think this looks. So he walks that out. What about the front? Well, I would like to do the fronts too. That one was. You want to double wrap it or do you think I'll oh, hold it up? Am I too high now? Oh, we nicked his foot too. Yeah. Can you get under his claws? Yeah. Sorry.
They made a motion at the meeting about this. I guess Mike had to trim one of the guy's bull's hooves, eh? So they said they're sending them home now. Yep. When we had the bull committee, there was lots of them, Clark, that I, I said, trim well, his feet or don't bring them out. Well, you can't do that because now this is going to take them two, three weeks to heal. Yep. And that's the beginning of your breeding season. That just doesn't work, right? You know, it's standing on it and it just went oh, through. Oh, yeah, because there's the weight on it. It didn't, well, it didn't vibrate at all. Maybe I can get it from the other side now. Then if he lifts it, you can, okay. you can, you can pick it up. It come? come off. Oh, yes. At least he's quiet, Take eh? One corner off, Clark. That is a solid chunk of beef cost us a lot of feed. I don't think this little guy can see out of this. We made two patches here out of one jean pocket. Oh, I don't know. See, I don't think he can even see. He can just feel. I don't know if we're going to do that one. that holds. So Corey coached me, said leave the bottom of the pocket open. That was the nicest pair of jeans I owned. But because gravity works against me, I ripped them right down the middle at the back smiling okay let's go forward hey let's go forward hey 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 let's go forward come on come on shopping this morning I gotta tell you really liking this new this new 
new mustache. Look at an antelope right there. Maybe he will too. But the reality is, is that, and I'm sure you guys did too, everybody who looks at me, I get a smile from them. I think I'll keep it. And the reality is, I think you guys should try to get a smile from somebody today. See what it does to you. When somebody looks at you and smiles, ha, hey, give somebody a smile. You will make their day. Just look at or whoever it may be, the next person you see, and just smile at them and see if it just changes something within them. I cut my hair, he cuts his beard. <laughs> down once it gets out straight that way and then we got to go grab these two straps laying over here let's grab one of these so then you hook oh that wire you hook onto this wire and then start rolling it out and then start rolling it out and walking towards the cows. If they stop, then you'll need to jump out and just push them. But once they get to that hole, they'll run in and then we gotta go up the road and push. Let it warm up a little bit, right? 